Hey, Stephen Bonacor, the pod father of gaming here. I'm at Last Night Games booth. I'm talking to Jake. This is booth 959. That's right. In the back row. It is worth coming here, I'm telling you right now. These guys have got two games to show off, two games to sell. Well, they got one game, one selling and one is kickstarting. Is that what it was? That's exactly right, Stephen. Tell, tell me about the one you want to talk about first, the one you uh, have for sale. Yeah, let's talk let's about Let's talk this. about Life of a, of a Chameleon. Changing colors, I bet, in this guy. Yeah, so in Life of a Chameleon, you get to play the role of a chameleon. And you change colors throughout the game to sneak up on bugs that match your colors so you can eat them to of complete course. objectives. Right, so it's a little bit of an abstract game. Uh, it's a little bit of strategy there, two to four players, ages 12 and up. Uh, it's got a ton of different colorful Can I take a look at this stuff? Yeah, yeah this absolutely. stuff is really pretty looking. Maybe you can pick it up. I know we're not going to be able to get a good shot over there for the for camera. Sure. For the camera, but really pretty looking um, wooden pieces. This all is the production copy, right? This is right in the box right yeah, now. This is available for sale right now, right here in the booth. What do you, what's the price point on this? It's $40 at the, at the show here today. So. Okay, got very, very cool. And what, how's, what's the mechanics like in this game? There's quite a few different mechanics. Um, you, there's some area kind of movement going on. You move around, collect things uh, to complete objectives, pretty simple. There's some other side components. There's a surprise ending, which is kind of nice. Oh, there's, really? So the game's gonna end differently every time you play it? That's right. Every Every time you complete an objective, you actually move down this progress track, uh, which you can see when the marker gets towards the end, the game kind of surprise ends, whether you're ready for it or not, uh -huh, which is pretty okay. exciting. All right. uh, you think you're in control of the game and you haven't won and maybe it doesn't end on time and, and you have to keep going or maybe it ends early. So that's an interesting mechanic. And then the main thing, of course, is the chameleons themselves as you get to change colors uh, to, to match the card that you oh, have drawn. Right? These, which, these things are adorable multicolor chameleons here very very cool <laughs> so that's life of a chameleon how many players did you say it was and how long does it take to play it's two to four uh it can be 30 minutes if it's two players it can be 60 minutes if it's your first time four players sure interesting thing uh it did win the mensa select award uh, just last nice. month which is really exciting this is for brainy people uh <laughs> sure no it's for everybody no, um for there much. is a deeper strategy though than it looks so it's cool it's a lot of fun yeah very cool and now you got something else that's actually going to kickstarter when is the kickstarter going to start for yeah. the finest fish so kickstarter just Let's make sure are we, live, are, we are we still in that fish? shot let me make sure yeah here we go here we are, the, finest fish. the finest fish coming to kickstarter when uh it just launched oh. already so so wow so people can right go now right now on the Kickstarter and look for the finest fish. That's right, you can just search for the finest fish on Kickstarter. We got a QR code here at the booth you can scan if you want. A um, little card you can take with you so that you can and find it. Let me tell you, these are some fine looking fish here. <laughs> the this finest. Is, this is a dual layer fish. It's actually got two pieces in there. Very cool. Yeah. So Tell me about this game. Fish, it's, a, it's a tile drafting and a tile placement game. So as you can see, everyone chooses their own little fish board. There's different colors, different shapes. Uh, my favorite's the little black one, I'm going to be honest. Um, you draft these tiles and they lay right here on the boards. Oh, that's neat. So as you go about building your fish, uh, you're trying to complete objective patterns. Uh, you can see there's different pattern cards oh. that you might want to complete. There's ways to score that way. Uh, you can also score points by putting fish scales that are the same color next to each other, kind of creating clusters of same color scales. Are you, are you like um, pulling out of a bag to see what you get on each turn? Yeah. How's, the, how's the turn work? So the mechanic is a, is a drafting mechanic. So there's a couple of piles of scales that are out there and starting with the player with the advantage token, you go through and you each pick which pile you want and you place them on your fish. Now it's way more complicated than that, of course. That wouldn't course. be too exciting. So as you're drafting these scales, you can either choose to place them on your fish, you can spend them to buy new objective cards, or you can trade them with the community fishbowl. And the interesting thing is when you spend or trade tiles, they go into this community fishbowl and they become available for your competitors to use. So you have to be very careful to balance about what you're giving on to what use you're giving versus, up, right. what you're using, everything like that. So right. it gives some depth there. So we got, this is um, ages 12 plus, 30 yep. to 60 minutes, two to four. Sounds yep. similar um, from the other one. And uh, on Kickstarter right now. On Kickstarter right now. But you can come here and take a demo of it. Absolutely. Right? Excellent. Anything else you want to mention? No. <laughs> Stop on by, right? Stop on by. So <laughs> this is Jake yeah. and Nate also in the background here. You come back to see these brothers here for last night games in booth 959. Did yeah. I get it right? Yeah. You know, I do actually have one last thing. Oh, one last thing. We got something else for you. We, we have a little activity. If you want to stop by, you can paint a little chameleon button, uh, put on your lanyard. Oh. We've got paint markers. We've got chameleons. Come stop by. That sounds one, awesome. Stick it on your lanyard. I'm coming back and painting. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> I need an activity today besides <laughs> this. Anyway, last night games, booth 959. They've got 
let's life of a chameleon life of a chameleon right now to buy and take a demo of and the finest fish on kickstarter you can check this one out here too i'm stephen bonacore the podfather of gaming for origins tv i'll see you again soon